there, and welcome back to Second World. My name is Alice, and today we are back for more Hogwarts Legacy. Last time, well, we kind of completed the game last time. We beat Ranrock. Uh, sadly, Professor Fig uh, met his demise as well, but he had some heartwarming thoughts and words from Professor Weasley and kind of from Professor Black, who, if I remember, he's... Oh, man, he was over here. I was going to go and talk to him. I'll see if I could, but he's gone now. All right, then. Uh, we have one more thing to do, and I can confirm that, yes, you can keep playing after we complete this story mission. Um, you get the credits, and then you can come back into it if you still got things to do, which I inevitably will. Um, we have to get to level 34, which is possibly going to take a while. We have a few side quests to do. We're going to go speak to Sebi Seb first. Um, wherever he is, he's in the Undercroft, actually. I didn't know where he was. Uh, yeah, we'll go this way. Um, but yes, we're basically going to try and get here. We've got to speak to Natty. We've got to speak to Seb. Probably got to find a lot of field pages. Uh, now there are 40 levels in the game. So we obviously won't have meach, meached, reached max level. You can wait as well and not do this bit until you've 100% completed it. Because then you are like, done, done. Um, I do need to go this way. Um, but I am not going to do that. We're going to go. We're going to get to level 34. We're going to get the thing. And that is how we're going to end the episodic chapters of this game as i said in the last episode um hopefully it won't take us too long but if it does then we're here for a little bit of fun go a bit faster holloway uh i've also read because now i don't have to fear spoilers um there were two endings so of all the times where the game has been like there's no morality it genuinely doesn't matter what you pick had I have picked the option to open the repository rather than keep it sealed when I had that choice in... Ba -ba -da -ba -dum. <laughs> I got super distracted, sorry. When I had that choice with Figgy, I could have chosen to uh, open it rather than keep it sealed. You get a different ending. So, if you want a different ending to me, that's what you got to do. But there are two different endings of this game. Not much in it. Still the same outcome with Fig and the rest of it um in fact i don't know if you do have the same ending with fig because you don't need him to close the thing if you choose to reveal it hey ommy for stopping van rock and his loyalists oh thank, thank you. you thank you for having a different line of dialogue rather than calling me a show off all right sebi but yes there is a different ending go find it go play the game just to get that different ending <laughs> You can have a completely different play experience if you don't choose Gryffindor and you don't choose to see the repository at the end. Aside from that, it's the exact same game. <laughs> All right, Sebi, what you got for me, bro? I don't think there's much more to do with you either. I think I've just got to talk to you. Hello. I'm Please don't offer me to do anything. Sebastian, I received your owl. What's happened? Ominous spoke with Anne about what happened with my uncle Solomon. She believes I should pay for what I did, but she won't really? turn me in. She said the guilt I'll have to live with is punishment enough. Well, yeah, I'm you so kind of did go a bit overboard on that one. I that still think it was an overreaction. Now. The thing is, I think I've lost my sister, my twin, forever. She refuses to even see me. Well, you didn't have to kill her. him. I couldn't really blame any of you if you gave up on me entirely. You all believed in me, and I let you all down. I'd agree with you, man. Okay, well, we'll go with the top one because we're going to be nice to him and I haven't managed to do that very well for this playthrough. Anna just needs some time. Surely one day she'll be able to forgive you. Probably not. I hope you're right. I don't I think I am. I can't undo what's been done, but I can try every day to make up for it. I owe you an ominous everything for standing by me. Well, well it wasn't easy. Trust. But I believe in you, Sebastian. I've had a sense about you since that first day in defense against the dark arts. Seems so long ago. It was so long Thank ago. You. Fifty no bloody hours ago. Come, but I'm grateful for your friendship. You're very welcome. And that's it. I'm glad you came to Hogwarts. Thanks. I am too. And that Seb story complete as well. Oh, that 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 shield is looking good. All right. Um, that's it. There's nothing more to do with Seb. There's nothing more to do with Poppy. There's nothing more to do with Seb. That is their quest over. This one, however, I think we've got a little bit more to do. Uh, what now? Why is that in here? 
It really isn't. It, wow. Okay. Yeah. No. Nope. <laughs> How close can I flew to you, sir? Ma'am? Woman? Where are you? Oh, my God. Oh, God damn it. Why are you over here? Uh, okay. No, no. We've got a relatively close flu flame. Let's go to this one. And we'll fly the rest of the way. Because this is what I mean. There's the whole world that needs... I'm in the water. Where am I? Oh, I'm here. Hey. Okay. Can I... Curious now. Can I run back in here? Can I go back in here? No. Well, I guess not. Okay. Uh, Natty! Donde estas? I can't fly here. You wanky piece of wank. I deliberated whether I was going to say that for a very long time. Turns out that was irritating. I could get on me grab horn. I want the unicorn as well. There's a unicorn in this game somewhere. Maybe Natty will get me to the unicorn. Natty! What in the... What is that? Kites. Cute. Everyone should be... I should not be attacked by anything. Go away. Go away. Oh, look at that. You're so far behind me, no one cares. Whee. Natty! Oh, I gotta wait for you in the night time? Alrighty. I'll wait. Are you ready to finish Harlow? Morning. Guess I am. I've got nothing more I'm else to do, to be fair. Once and for all. I finished Rookwood, so this should be easy. An owl from Mrs. Bickle. Mm -hmm. She wondered if we were having any luck going after Harlow. Suggested mm. we could gather evidence from a friend near Manor Cape. But okay. she warned us to stay out of it. Was rather adamant about it. Precisely. Harlow knows that we saved Archie and that we rescued Mr. Rabe. The letter didn't come from Mrs. Bickle, did it? I do not believe it did. Hallow intends to ambush us, <gasps> but now no. we have the upper hand. We can prepare. I got we 15 Wigan Weld. And he knows it. That's uh, why he's shit, resorting not a spouse. to trickery. We must go. Okay. We should take a moment. Why? Nah. I'm ready. Agreed. Let's do it. Let's finish this. Let's Brilliant. finish this. Go in sneak sneak mode though. Hallow's reign I've... ends today. Where are we going? Perhaps we ought to inform Officer Singer of our plans. Probably. I already sent her an owl to let oh, her know that we were following a lead given to us by Mrs. Bickle. Are you concerned she might tell your mother? Indeed she will, but so be it. What I is wrong with your character right her. now? <laughs> My mother needs to understand that I will not be safe She wants to run, but she doesn't want to run. Is. I shall I'm staying... I'm, finished. I'm staying in, in sneaky sneaky mode, because... I just got a feeling that, I mean, I know I'm freaking out your character because it wants to run, but it can't because it's got to stay close enough to me. But at the same time, I feel like there's going to be baddies in here. See? I sense he is close. Search for signs of Harlow. Where is he? I do not know. Hey. We should look around. There's evils. Hi. Did you find me already? Children, okay. Right Bye. <laughs> nope, nope. That's I got. Whoop! Ow! Bastard! Hit! Bonk! Bonk! Oh god! There's a fairy! 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 Ow! You pack a freaking punch as well, you bitch! Miss me, bitch. Bonk! Where are the others? Oh, 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 yes, please. This is fun. Would you? Oh my actual god! Get out of here. Get out of here. Shit! Where is my spell? Okay, can I just bounce for a minute? Okay. Kraken. I'm feeling better now. Shit! 
Come on, man. I've, I've changed where those spells are. They're not where I think they are anymore. Okay. Boom! Miss me, bitch. Lumos, really? I got it. I got it. Yeah, I don't really know why I've got Lumos going on, but that'll do. All right, well, we got him. Little Nat's Ionai, in it. Oh, hey, hey. And her excruciatingly loyal companion. It's all right. Your boss is dead, bro, and I killed him. You two have done quite Come a bit of damage to my business interests. Have we really? <laughs> but I must gradually give you some credit. What really? was once a mere annoyance has become remarkably problematic. Fortunately, I pride myself on my problem-solving skills. It does just look like a stick, to be fair, bro. Two against one, man. I think we got him. Ooh. Where's he at? Shit. Whoop. Shit. I pressed the wrong button. Natsai, get me down. Sweetie. Boom! 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 Bitch! Come here, you cowards! Cowards! Boom, bitch. Protificus to what now? I'm sorry, you didn't finish! Where's everybody? Did I find him? I did! Mega! Alright, now so you got him, I'll get this one. Shit, you went. Where'd he go? Woo! There he is. Hi! Bitch! Die, 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 dying everywhere! Merrily, 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 dying everywhere! Dodge! My magic's over here. I don't know where you are. There you are. Oh, hey, so we can well. Can I just grab that super quick? Cheers, bro! Thanks, lad. You're a dude, man. Let me grab that. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Whoop! Where is he? Whoop! Whoop! Oh, he's right here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Where's he at? Where's he at? There we go. Boom, baby! He's got to be down. Yes! That's how we do it. That's how we do it like a doddle. So easy. Circle, circle. Circle, circle. X! Shit, 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 shit. You changed the, 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 the button. Easy, bro. Bro, you're not even hard, man. And you're dead, too. I am straight up just killing bitches. Oh, no, you're not dead yet. All right, great. Awesome. I'm glad you're not dead. Why are you not dead? <clears throat> Stay down if you know what's good for you. <sighs> Careful, Natsai. Because he's probably going to come for you. Well, that was a choice. I mean, get him, and then that stops. Oh, yeah, good job. Expelliarmus works well. It was Crucio. She'll be fine. She'll walk it off. If she dies from Crucio, she's a weak-ass bitch. I've got no chill for that. <laughs> Oh, I'm so compassionate. <laughs> hey! Harrow's last stand. There she goes. Told you, she's fine. She walked it off. Oh, God, that was nothing. 180 XP for that. I'm going to have to go beat up some bitches, aren't I? Hi, guys. I'm sure you are up for a visitor. I mean, I'm already here, yes, so it would be a bit awkward fine. to say no now. And it will do me good to see am I in the hospital friend. wing? Oh, I am. Hi. Very well, but do not overdo it. Not it was that. only Crucio, know, Jesus. Mother. Come on, man. It could have been so much worse. Are you staying or leaving or You're leaving. Okay, cool. It is good to see you, my friend. Hello. 
I'm glad to see you're doing so well. Be stronger. I'm better than it appears. Crucio, for God's sake. I am sake. only here because my mother insisted just to be safe. Fine. I was relieved when she told me that you were all right. I was perfectly fine. I wasn't even in danger. Thanks to you, I guess. Only because of you. How are you feeling? I mean, well, throw well, a protego, you I know what I mean? I better days. But no Again, he's telling us. Disarm the Maddie. prick before he can shoot me. Heart. What? No. Do not blame yourself for this. She's fine. The moment that I saw Harlow aim his wand at you, well... Expelliarmus. You quickly made the choice to protect me. I did what I had to, and I would do it again. I could not simply stand there and let Learn you Expelliarmus. It's a real you. helpful spell of in that situation. Not. There was nothing... Sorry, I should you... be talking of him. Oh. Oh, my... I cannot believe that it took me this long to see it. I'm confused. He made a choice based on instinct. Oh, my God, write this. You, my friend, are no more to blame for my injuries today than I am to blame for my father's sacrifice years ago. From what we'll call I that growth. Him, it seems there's a lot of your father in you. I'd That's agree. very kind of you to say. I hope that you are right. I know that I am. This has all been a bit much, hasn't it? Hey, look, they're both dead. Here at Hogwarts, <laughs> so. Everything we have done to take down Harlow and the rest of Rookwood's lot. I gotta go take down but some more, man. I ain't got it. enough XP. Rookwood is dead. Harlow is on his way to Azkaban. And the rest of them are on the run. Mm -hmm. A few of the dregs will still be about, fighting for their lost cause. But Rookwood's enterprise has fallen apart. Well, yeah, because he's dead. Everything is safe dead. now because of us. Because of you. Uh, because then of me, you, actually, but, but whatever. A formidable team. You, my fellow traveller, have enriched my time at Hogwarts beyond anything I could have imagined. Yay! Thank you. I believe your friendship to be one of the most important in my life. Well, look at that. Three character stories. Coming. Yay! Acting on instinct. Done. Okay, a little bit more XP there. That's pretty good. Here's the new problem. That's it now. <laughs> I don't have anything else to do. Oh boy. Okay, right. Let's. Not there. It's not where I'm meant to go. 69%. Ay. I'm a child. I always press the wrong button. Sorry. <laughs> I think we should leave it here. 69% is a great place. Uh, Explore H field guide pages. Oh, we're nearly done though. 88%. Collect all the field pages in the Highlands. See, now it says this. Complete, collect 50 pages in Hogwarts. But I have not got them all. Okay, so there's... Oh, there's apparently one more in Hogsmeade. Let's go to Hogsmeade first. Um, let's try and complete those challenges. And if I wander across people who need to be beaten up... I kind of like to do that because it's going to be the quickest way to build this level, I think. Um, but sure, let's go to Hogsmeade first. Oh, I don't really care where. i got to find the... See, field guide pages, 127 out of 150. There's still so many more. My good Christ. Ugh, it's going to really annoy me if it makes me collect all the field guide pages. I'm just saying. Um... Yeah, 46 out of 55. This is what doesn't make sense to me. Why are you giving me a reward when I haven't finished the quest? You know what I mean? Just don't give me the reward until I've got them all. And then I know I've got them all. Well, let's say 46 out of 55. So there's... 9 in Hogsmeade. Somewhere. Oh, Christ, Biscuits. Well... I hope we enjoyed... This game has now just become the Revelio game. That's literally all I'm going to be doing now. Because I don't reveal pages unless I'm near them. Although I think this is more going to be a case of the ones that are in the air. Money. Um, I don't think they're going to be in the shops. <laughs> I'm already bored of this game. Revelio. Already bored of the game. Doing this to me. Now, there wasn't one in here that I didn't get, was there? That would be deadly annoying. I wish there was a better way to find them than this. 
There has to be a better way to find them than this. There has to be some in the air. Oh, God, fathers. Oh, boy. It's the Dedalian keys all over again. Come on. Is there a frame in here? You genuinely moved super slow and it really annoys me. Oh god. Good, now I'm stuck on things. Gloves. Unidentified hat. No. Aha. Where is that frame? Loomis. Okay, Loomis is on one of these. Here we da, 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 da. Your frame is up here somewhere, sir. I don't exactly know where. I just know it's up here somewhere. Oh. Well, it seemed content on that, but I don't know where the frame is. So, I reckon it's inside? It's not here, is it? It's got to be inside somewhere. Come on, Mr. Moth. Oh, really? Oh no, now I'm getting stuck on stupid things. I gotta be honest, I didn't even check this was the right moth for the frame. Frame, I just kind of assumed. Wait, that's a field guide, isn't it? Yeah! 80 XP. And that's complete. I mean, it's not complete. I hate the fact that it does this, but I get this now, so yay. Um, I can find that reward. Five out of eight in the Highlands. Oh my god. So it's it's all those little things now, isn't it? That's what that's Rebecca. what is going to um, <coughs> make this possible. There's nothing else over here, I don't think. There are eight more field guide pages in Hogsmeade somewhere. This episode just got really boring. Oh, oh look, there's another one of these these uh, hedgy things. Hedgy, hedgy, hedgy dragons. It's in here. I see him. Where is he? There he is. What are these things? What am I to do with them? Incendio. Does that not help you? You don't want to be incendioed. Nothing. You're just here. Okay. Well, I still don't know what they do. <laughs> so. Uh, la 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 la. Alright, let's at least start somewhere sensible, like the beginning. Keep an eye on the sky as well. Looking for absolutely anything that could generate a field guide page or. See, I can fly here, which means it's not Hogsmeade. Is there one out here, like, stupidly, like, right here, that I would have potentially missed? Nope. Alright, we're moving on. I had to be a little bit methodical about this. Yeah, I just... Well, I didn't stroke Rebellion. you, but I just petted your friend, and we just did that, so we're not going to do that again. Uh, there's a something up there. I think that's the hatch to the cellar. <laughs> Oh, I'd love some form of direction as to where this stuff is. Okay, big jingle's coming in for over here. Oh, oh. Very loud, very loud. Oh, <gasps> yes! Gotcha! Hogsmeade Community Garden. This small community garden in the heart of the village is a perfect spot for growing various herbs and peaceful magical plants. Give me the XP. That didn't give me an XP, did it? So this is now... A pointless task because that didn't give me any xp for that that's literally what it says i should turn the it just wants me to okay right fine then in which case no i'm not running around looking for pages i can't find and i can just go and fight people hogsmeade square <gasps> unicorn yes let's go and do this it's a great idea yes i want a unicorn it's the only creature i don't have I can't jump over a wall now. Really? Woman? Jesus, woman. Lady! Lady, where's the unicorn? 
Lady. Tell me about the unicorn. Hey! Wrong button. I beg your pardon, but is everything all right? I'd love to help you out. Bless you. Oh, thank you for asking. I'm Betty. Betty Bugbrook. And no, everything is not all right. All right, Betty, lay it on me. Dear friend Hazel. Oh, no. She's in trouble. <gasps> no! Yes. Oh, she's a unicorn. No one else. Hazel the cares. unicorn. She doesn't like to leave the Oh, forest, I never named so the toads. I visit her once a week to brush out her mane and bring her some treats. Her coat is... Glorious. Let's let's get to the well, point. The last time I saw her, we were violently attacked. Oh, I can deal with them. Wolves. In fact, I need to for loyal friend that she is dueling things left in front to protect me and in the process. I fear she may have been injured. Oh I'm no. I'm sorry to hear that. I want to help her, but she seems to have gone into hiding. Out of fear, I'd imagine. I know you Hogwarts students learn a fair bit about caring for beasts. Yep. Perhaps you could find my unicorn friend and get her somewhere safe so that she can heal. I can put her in the room of requirements. How did you become so close with the unicorn? And then name my jokes. It was luck, truly. I came across her when she was a little golden foal. Didn't even have a horn yet. Aw, cute. Oh, she trusted me straight away. We'd play together for hours. Oh, I do hope she'll be all right. Unicorn hair is a valuable wand core, and I suppose losing a hair or two also, mightn't hurt her. But I'm a terrified valuable will tool for me for to upgrade my gift to keep themselves alive. And that is more than I can bear to think of. Sorry, right, I want it. Don't you stress I'll it. Keep an eye out for your unicorn friend and take her to safety if I see Keep her. an eye out now. I'm on this now, mate. You knew there was a unicorn in the game. I can always tell. <laughs> Please don't risk your own safety, though. Mate, I need the I don't XP. Know precisely so. where she is, but I can tell you that her den is north of Hogsmeade. All right, we're and heading north of Hogsmeade. I haven't been able to brush her lately. I imagine she still has the brightest, most beautiful. There's coat more than one of them. Herd. Ooh, that's a game changer. Remember, you'll know her by her brilliant coat. Yeah. All right. Go, go, go! Because I can't fly here yet. I, need I gotta to get out of Hogsmeade. I gotta like get out trouble. of Hogsmeade. I gotta get out of Hogsmeade. So I can fly on my boom. Am I out now? I'm gonna be out now. I'm out now. Yeah, boy. Let's go. Something spoiled me. It's been ages Whee. since I've found anything worth poaching near Crancroft. We good lord, there's a lot of people here. And everybody wants to kill me. Hazel must be here <gasps> somewhere. Wait, there's something like right on me. Landing is unavailable, but here I am, having landed. Uh let's just super quick. Okay, so it doesn't even look like it's a dueling feat. I've just gotta find the unicorn. Where are they? Unicornies! It's just a unicorn. But it's a unicorn all the same. Okay, so let's just have a little think see here. I'm gonna need that, I'm gonna need that, and I'm gonna need this. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> I maybe knocked the unicorn over. Got it! That is the wrong unicorn, but it was a male unicorn, which is why I grabbed it. Because I figured... Let's just get XP for that. Go away. I figured... Scary music. Uh, there's more than one unicorn. Which means I can breed them. And for that, I needed a man. A man unicorn, I did. I don't see any other unicorns! Come on, Hazel. Unicorns! Unicorns! I'm in your den now. Come, come, unicorns. I'm walking into danger. Oi! Unicorns! You were just here! Where are 
are you now? And I'm so sorry. Are you Hazel? Be Hazel. That would be really helpful for me if you were Hazel. Hazel? Hazel the unicorn. Thank you. It's alright Hazel, I got you. Ooh, you are pretty. I can take Hazel back to a Vivarian now. I should let Madame Bob I certainly can. Miss. Ah, only 30 XP though. Alright, well. Perhaps then, if I just take a moment to uh, reset my... Okay, let's just wait a minute and just reset my entire wheel, shall we? I'm just going to go up and sing and beat some people up. Why not? Unless they're speeders. Oh, shit, they're speeders. Fuck! Well, that didn't work. Somehow changed spell wheels without even noticing I had. Is there another baddie down here? No, I think it's just a speeder. Speeder. I'll get the money though. Why not? Money. Maybe I'll run it back because then this way I can um, hopefully run into some people and get some XP at the same time. I just have to start taking on um, camps. I think it's going to be quicker because apparently collecting field guide page books is not... Unless it's... Hello. What are you? You're another spider. Okay. Bonk. Whatever that is. Uh, I feel like I'm going the wrong way. Where am I? Oh, spider's den. Boo. No, I don't want to go in there. Where are you now? <laughs> and I'm so sorry. I actually probably need to get some more Disney leaves. Can I jump up here? How? Can you jump up there? Whatever. Not caring. Don't give a shit. Need some more people to attack. Ooh, I need some more. Hey, my favorite flowers in the whole wide world. There's a camp up there. Should we go do it? I think we should go do it. I think I'm ready. I think I'm prepared. I want the XP. This is completely now just a game of getting XP. This is all we're doing. We're kind of up over here somewhere. Whereabouts are they? Hello? I've come to raid your camp. I've come to let you know the people you work for are all dead, and uh, you may as well give it up. What do you think about that? I think I'm right, you're wrong, and uh, there's nothing you can do about it. Ow! Freaking dog, man. Okay. I need maybe do some cool shit. Oh, got it. Where are you at? Where are you at, bro? Come here. Die, bitch. Oh, it's an Animagus. So oh, definitely attack it with uh, that then. Where you at? Miss me, bitch. Where are you? Why can't I see you? Come here. Oh shit! Gotcha. Really? Only twenty XP? Oh, I'm drinking butter beer. <laughs> Only twenty XP for clearing a camp? Are you serious right now? Oh, is this camp not clear? I'm pretty sure it's clear. I think I won. Oh yeah, ambush two. Nice. Yay! It's got tick bite, which means it's clear. Seriously? That's it? Wow, we're going to have to do a lot more camps then. Hang on, there's a chest around here somewhere. Oh, Mr. Chest. Oh, what's that? Oh, excuse me, just going to steal your shit. Hope you don't mind. Money. 
Oh, there's a... Okay, well, that was a chest. Cool. Uh, yeah, what is this thing? This blue thing over here. What is it? Hello? Can I... What do I reckon? Nope, I meant for... I didn't... I haven't loaded it. It should be here. What do I reckon we have to do with this, then? Now I have nothing. Absolutely nothing. Let's just walk through it. Collect. Few witches or wizards correctly trace the history of Scotland's indigenous mazes back to their rightful source. The 15th century dark wizard known as Eunon Blackwood. Born Eunon Wood to a non-magical branch of the Wood family, Eunon was misunderstood by his muggle parents and in an effort to fit in sought solace in the family trade, hedge trimming. He could allegedly control the blackthorn bushes with his mind, creating beautiful designs with ease. This both impressed and infuriated his rather intolerant family. Their resentment to... Hang on, can I... What now? Okay. So no. Their resentment on... Only worsened upon young Yunon's invitation to Hogwarts where he was sorted into Hufflepuff House. It was at Hogwarts that Yunon first met one Artemisia, Artemisia Black, disowned by the Black family for her mother's da dalliance with Artemisia's muggle father. The half-blood, Artemisia's relationship with the blood purity was a com with blood purity was a complex one. She considered herself worthy of her mother's maiden name and blamed her father for her ostracation at the same time she did not fault wood for his muggle parentage but rather considered him too an unwilling innocent victim of muggle impurity why is that important to anything oh it's a thing i have to do something with it oh my god there's so much in this game i'm also just gonna do this right because <laughs> it's taking a long time if i find anything to beat up i'll stop i can't beat you up you're a nice person Wrong button to boost. Okay, back it out a little bit. Just come out of a little bit. There you go. Thank you very much. And Aaron hogs me. Someone's gonna boot me right now. But I should get some HP for this, should I not? You better give me HP, woman. I saved a unicorn for you. And I only got 30 XP for catching it. <laughs> I mean, I knew this episode would be a little bit like this. Hello. I got your unicorn. Bugbrook, I found your unicorn friend, Hazel. She's very pretty. Oh, what a relief. Is she all right? Yeah, she's all good. Are you all right? I'm good. Do you have a safe place for her to stay? I think so. <laughs> for a fee. Pay me, bitch. No, oh, I don't need money. And I have a safe place for her at Hogwarts. You have a kind heart, you do. I'm relieved and thankful that you'll take care of her. Welcome. I shall miss my sweet pointy pony, but I know she's safer away from the poachers. <gasps> do give her a nice brushing for me, won't you? Will do. Give me the XP. Take XP. Good care of Hazel XP. Now. XP. Thank you. XP. Give me the XP. 180! That was worth it. What are my dueling feats or my these things? I don't know if I'll get XP for it, but. Oh, I never one of those is. And it's actually on my way back to Hogwarts. So let's head and get that. If I can remember where the bloody hell I am, where I'm trying to go. This way. Cool. I think this way. Oh, I don't know now. I might be a bit lost. I am lost. This is not where I intended to be. Yep, up we get. There you go. Uh, I definitely think I just ran in a circle. That's the way I want to go. Wait a second. Oh, I think that's just dinging me for this stuff. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Hello. Yep. There's one. Where is it? There it is. Dum, dum, dum. T-shop decor reflected 
Reflective of the proprietor Mrs. Steepley's taste, this tea shop is awash with the color pink and thrills. A cheery, tinkly bell chimes whenever a customer enters. I am here to rob your shit. Or I see you have shit to rob. Slurp away, missus. Come on, up we go. Can you go any faster up these stairs? Thank you, thank you. There's the big chest. There it is. Hell yeah. Extra, extra, read all about it. Should we read the newspaper? It might be about me. Dricken remains at large. A fire-breathing chicken, nicknamed the Dricken, remains at large. The news is frustrating the locals of New Key, the town terrorized by the beast, many of whom were hoping for a swift end to the Sega. It's a bloody chicken. We're witches and wizards. How hard can it be to capture? Said one concerned witch with a noticeable singe on her sleeve. But not everyone in New Key shares this sentiment. Speaking exclusively to the Daily Prophet, one Cornish wizard said, Don't know why we can't find the little lady a safe place to nest. Of course, I suppose a wooden coop wouldn't work. Just think anyone with a solid aguamenti charm could take her in. Okay, well, that's irritating. I thought it was going to be about me. And the demise of Ranrock. But I guess that's not important enough news for you randoms. Anything evil down here? Oh, yeah, lots of evils. Where are they? Where are you? There it is. Nicely done, woman. Ow, you piece of shit. Now you get to die for that. Well, you would if I could use spells. Miss me. Sucks to be you! Nice, 50 XP. Oh, sorry, I'm skimming stones. That's what I was after. Randomly, I want that tongue, apparently. Uh, there's more speeders over there. Pointless. Where's the other one? Hello? Hello? God, this is too easy to kill them now. How am I doing? Oh. Yep, this was my combat traits. So that's that one. I'll claim this reward though. Need to take down 10 more of them. And this one is nowhere near being done. Okay. Does it, does it tell me? No, it doesn't. Boy, oh, that's annoying. Okay. Um, let's go do the Merlin trial that's here. Because oh, there's also other things to beat up over there. Um, it might. You know what that means, Merlin trial. It might give me some XP for completing the Merlin trial. Where are these evil thingies, though? There they are. Confringo. Can I not like aim at you? Am I not close enough to you? Well, you've spotted me now. Okay. Oh, really, really, get out of the water, you idiot! Get out of the water, you idiot! one you dealt with. Can I really not aim at you? Because you're going to detect me in a minute. I can't really get much closer to you, sir. There you go. Now I can. That was stupid. Sweet. Okay, that's three done. Get out of the water, woman. Oh, for goodness sake. Yeah, this was smart, wasn't it? That's exactly what I wanted you to do. Get out of the water! Thank you! Lumos. Come on, that's close enough, no? Thank you. Will you see no now because I can't jump? Oh, okay, we'll just walk them over here. Give me four and a half years, guys. Just gotta get them over here. Oh, now you'll climb. Lumos. Okay, sorted. That's one. Yes, I see it. Thank you, game. I see what it is I need to do, and I see where it is they need to go. Okay, 
it. They're just three for this one, do we reckon? Or do we think more than three? Oh no, that's one I've already done. Whoa, whoa. That's one I've already done. It's over here. Yes, I see you. I see you. Lumos. I do like that they just stay where they were when I put them down. So tricky after all. Yay! 80 XP, that was worth it. That was worth it. Slowly but surely we're getting there, guys. Just uh, bear with me. What are these over here? Wolfos? Wolfos? Revelia. What are you and where are you? There you are. Oh, you're spies. Boring. So very annoying. Oof. for that one not the good enough uh what's down here hello Revelia. where are they oh he's over there okay well he's seen me i'm nowhere near you my friend now I am. Still not really close enough for you to do any damage. Ah! Get the XP. Okay. Oh, there's another one in the water. Hi! Would you like to join your brethren? Confringo. Really? Not really the cleverest way to kill him but hey it's still 50 and i just need four more of those now so happy days hang on have the field guides been showing up on my thing all along Revelio. i need a ding somewhere there it is this is when i find out they've been uh milk flap tentacles ew Meltlap, meltlap tentacles are a rare potion ingredient known to raise resistance to a certain dark charm and contain healing properties. An overdose, however, can cause purple ear hair. Great, I'm just gonna steal your shit. Goodbye. Um, I guess there aren't any dangers here, though, are there? Where are the dangers? So many things tried to attack me all the time when I was flying around. Oh, hello. There's some over here. Hello, hello. Revelia. Please don't be spiders, be doggos. Yes. Easy. Oh, another one. Get him like this. And now he's a sheep. Alrighty then. Don't no cow. We're nearly there. It's just taking me. Little bit of time. Controls more, more good. Yeah, it did count. Okay, so I need uh four of those. I think I thought I thought I saw something down here too. Which will have been my little waterfied friends. There they are. Yes. yes. Hello, sir. Excuse me. Where are they? There they are. Hello. Whoop! Shit, didn't even see you there, bro. Ow. Probably won't focus on this one! Try some of these for a minute while things are on cooldown. Yeah, great. Help. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Oh, there he is. Nice. Two more of those required. What are... Oh, they're... 
Um, dragonflies. Cool. All right, we're doing well. And come on. Yeah, that didn't work at all. Whoop. More and they're over here. Coming for you. Where you at, bros? You stop. Boom, baby. Okay, that was the wrong button. So, collecting here. Uh, da, 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 da. Nope, not that one. I want this one. Thank you. I don't think that did anything for me though, did it? I'm very close. I've already done the Mallow Sweet bit. Yeah. What is going on in the area then? Okay, we've got that. That needs to go somewhere. I vaguely remember this. I started like six of them when I was looking for... Um, what do you call it? Dilling. Where is it? It's close to me. Kind of here. It's over here. Rebellion. There it is. There you go. The Tilted House. Locals call this the Tilted House due to the odd angle in which it sits wrapped in the roots of an overhanging tree. Okay, that was 80. Plus, I've only got to find two more field guide pages, and there's one over there, and then we get another... I don't see why it doesn't work. It's kind of over here. There it is. And it's over here. Rebellion. Beehives. Wizard World needs honey for their tea as much as the Muggle World does. Nice. Okay. Where the hell is this point? For this thing. Where has it got to go? Over there. Got it. Okay. Over here with it. Come along. You gotta go over here. Wait, that'll do. Really? I'm kind of over here somewhere. I think it's got to go over the bridge. Whoops. Well, I'm not going to make it over the bridge, am I? There we go. That'll do. La 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 la. Excuse me. Thank you. There it is. Got to go over here. La 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 Nicely done. Another ATXP. Challenge complete. Complete Mullen Trials. No, wait. I have not done them all. Really? No, I haven't. Ten of them. Another 14 plus. Jesus, there's a lot of them. Uh, pop all 10 sets of your balloons. Got 15 sets of your balloons. I haven't been here for a while. Ah, well, why didn't I do that earlier? For heck's sake. Um, actually, I should, yeah, let's go back in there and make sure I've got all of these things that I've unlocked. Find astronomy tables. I'm not doing great with those. Uh, solve one Hogwarts secret. Got it. Okay. Um, ba -dum -bum 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 bum 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 New inventory slots unlocked. New broom collected. Wonderful news for me. Okay, again, we're back on to find me a camp so I can clear it. Let's heading back towards Hogwarts. What the hell was that? 
No idea. I think I released an fairy. It happens. Oh, hello. Ancient magic spot. We'll do it. It's around here somewhere. Over here. Where do I need to go for this? Over here. Great. I think I only need to do one more of these, actually. Hmm. Also. Rebellion. Evil. It's fine. Oops. Oh, hey. I guess I go down. <laughs> Revelio. Lumos. Incendio. Bombarda. Wingardium Leviosa. Lumos. Revelio. No, that this page is above my head. If I'm not careful. I don't think I've ended up in the place I wanted to. Nope. No, no, no. This is not where I wanted to go. It's a new place to explore, but it's not where I wanted to be right now. I want to get the ancient magic. I want to find that field guide page, to be fair. Um, okay, so I've got to go up to get this ancient magic. Because it's up there. Can I not just climb this? No? Okay, it's fine. I mean, I could just completely cheat the system. I could fly to it. I don't feel like that's what it wants me to do. But I could. And I'm kind of tempted to because it doesn't say I can't. I don't know how else I would get to it. Where is it now? Where is it now? Is it over there? It is. Why do I feel like this one's supposed to be done on my broom? It's an inkling I'm having, you know what I mean? Where is it now? Rebellion. I hear it, but I don't see it. Where has it gone? Oh, really? Yeah, I don't know what you are. I'm trying to find a bit of ancient magic. Do you mind? Where the hell did it go? It can't be far from here. I think I'm going mad. Yeah, it's over there. Alrighty then. I really do feel like this one had to be done in my broom. That I was say, it's hard. usually three. Woohoo! Ancient magic! 100 XP. <gasps> Oh, that helped. That helped quite a lot. That really did. Now, if I go back here, actually, there's still a field guide page. And that might be enough to tip us over the edge, you see. So I'm going to try. Where is this down page? That's here. That's also eight from... Lace doily. The locals say this doily was left as a tribute to the beloved house elf who dreamed of one day wearing it. Oh, you're so mean to me. So close. Challenge complete. Incendio. Oh, that didn't work, did it? Hi, sir. Hey, how's it going? I wish to have not just used it. Oh my god, I'm so close now. Come on now. What are these butterflies and where are they? Butterflies. Rebellion. They're kind of up here somewhere. Butterflies. 
Tell you what. Hello. Great. They don't actually do anything for me though, do they? Ooh, I need like literally like four people to beat up. I feel like I'm very close now. Well, I am very close. That's why I feel like I'm very close. <laughs> um. Oh, come on. There's got to be a camp somewhere. Oh, 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 oh. I see lots of bad people in here. I bet there's spiders turning up. Where did I set my... Oh, no. Trap? Here we go. Hello. I see you. Let me have you God, that's easy. Really? One less poacher in the wizarding world. Man, damn it. Seriously? Come on. How much more do I need to do? Continue on. Searching for people to beat up. Hi. Hey, man. Oh, shit. There's two of them. I didn't even see you there, sir. Sir, 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 sir. Let's just talk about this. Let's just talk about this. Let's just talk about it, okay? I can't flipendo you. I don't know. Well, it's waiting to use a sneak attack. No, I don't have There's three of them. Okay, this is this has gone a little bit worse than I thought was going to happen. Just yeah, that's helpful. Revelio. Revelio. Are you serious right now? Heal. Heal! Alice, for God's sake. You're trying to stress me out much. Still not enough XP. So close. Oh, there's a blue flame over here I haven't got. Nice. I'm just going to keep going with these. Um... There you go. There's another one over here. There he is. It's currently on fire. Hello. Come on. How close can one person be? Literally. I could not be closer to this stupid next level. <sighs> Where is he? He's down below me now. I don't really care for sneak attacks at this point. Oh, there's a... There's a... Where is he? Where is he? Hello? I'm not friendly. Oh, there you are. Hi. Oh, you're quite aggressive, actually. You're still quite strong. Yeah, we're just doing these. Um, oh, come on! Where did I just see that um thingy? Astronomy thingy? Oh, is it the one in here? I've definitely done this before then. I remember seeing it. Yeah, yeah, it's a bit. <laughs> this is where I got stuck, and no, I kind of glitched the game. Likely studied here. Landing is available right now. Just land the damn broom. Oh, Christ, but don't fall off the edge, you cheese biscuit. This will also give me full on, um, on this. So hopefully, well, the next thingy of this I needed to do. Easy. Yep. 
Capricornus. So hopefully that's some XP. Yes! Oh! Boom, baby! Finally, my lord alive. That took its time. Um, complete Merlin's Trials. No, that's not the one I want. Landing platforms. No. That I can't get. That I can't get. Dude, it's this one here. Bonk. Uh, no, it's this one here. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Right, we are going straight to the Great Hall. I'm not going to fly it. I do apologize. Um, there is plenty more of this game. There's plenty more quests we could have done. Um, but I will be coming back to do those if people are interested in a live stream. If not, I'll just do them on my own time um, and finish the game quietly if no one wants to see any more of this. But damn it, at 50 episodes, I am pleased to inform we have come to the end of the game. These things take time. Good for you, Gareth. Good for you. Oh boy, this one took a moment. This one really did. Um, I could have done it quicker by just focusing on finding people um, and doing quests for them, but we got there in the end. Turns out you get 50 XP for every dung guy. And the best thing to do would be to do the ancient magic thingies. Oh god, I've glitched the game because I've triggered the suit of armor, which is now interfering with the cutscene. That banging should not be going on. It's good to know that even 50 hours in and two patch updates later, it's still glitchy. <laughs> the Lunicorn! Miss, I have one if you want to borrow one. In fact, I have two. Cruel. Hey, bullets. Ridiculous. I notice I'm not present in any of these uh, classes. Oh, there I am. <laughs> There's a broken statue. Hi! Hey, guys! My friend! Ah! This year, we have seen our students exemplify the bravery of Godric Gryffindor. Hell yeah! The loyalty of Helga Hall. The wisdom of Rowena Ravenclaw. Rowena Ravenclaw. The ambition of Salazar Slytherin. And so, the winner of this year's House Cup. Excuse me, Headmaster, if I may. Oh, God, Weasley stepping in again. Like, she's after your job, man. One particular student's heroism during the attack on Hogwarts, not to mention the level to which they have excelled in their coursework as a new student, no less. That's me, guys. Well, it would seem right here. That it certainly merits, oh, I'd say, 100 points. Well, at least you know where Dumbledore gets it from, eh? Wouldn't you agree? Ah, yes. Thank you, Professor Weasley. I wonder if you're a Slytherin student, I if it makes a difference. But the music balance again is so wrong. <laughs> Yay! We won the house cup! <laughs> yeah, I wonder if it's... if his reaction is different. Um if you're a Slytherin student. The music is so loud. Yay! We did it! We have completed Hogwarts Legacy. My good God. 
What a game. Really good game. Um, let's start with some of the nitpicky bits. Um, to, to start on a bad and then get to a good. Um, you know, it's, it's, I mentioned it a lot during the game. It's still very buggy. Um, and I'm now three months since I started... Jesus. Three months since I started playing this. Um, so you would have thought it would be less buggy by now. I'm curious why, like I said earlier, actually, I've only had two patch updates. One was before the last episode. And one was, uh, I don't know, about halfway through the game. So they're quite infrequent with the patch updates. There's still little things like that moth that completely glitched out. as reasons why I, I accused the game of glitching out when I got stuck on sections or when sections weren't clear, a bit like in the Ranrock fight last episode. Because it just seemed to be that it wasn't quite right. Something hadn't quite right gone right. Um, but, you know, all in all... I really enjoyed this game. I think sometimes the plot narrative was a bit weak and a bit pointless and confusing. And it's almost like, do you know what? Instead, just ask me to collect it for the sake of collecting it. I.e. The, the moons, the moon narrative was a bit lackluster. I think the climactal fight with Rookwood was also a bit rushed, suddenly paced. Whereas the Ranrock one in comparison felt really good. Nice balance. You had to kind of build your way through the repository and then have that big four stage boss fight with him at the end. Whereas with Rookwood, which was supposed to be the wizarding kind equivalent of Ranrock, you didn't really get that. Um, in terms of controls, most of my grievances with it was just my application of using it. It does, a bit like other games we've played, it does not... Um, it does not like button mashing. If you button mash, it basically stacks stacks your buttons. Um, I think God of War Ragnarok did the same. And so, yeah, I'm trying to protego. I'm trying to dodge, which was one of the things we were having a few episodes ago with the uh, with the grab hook, grab horn even, um, with the final keeper trial. We were trying to do things, and every time I tried to dodge, it was almost like I. Well, to be fair with that one, I'm still not happy with that one. The second phase, it just seemed like you physically couldn't dodge it. Um. But all in all, I think it was really good. Visually, the game's pretty good, pretty stunning. There's a couple of moments that are a little bit interesting. The audio balance, which I'll say now, as I feel like I'm trying to shout over the music, you won't be experiencing this because I'll drop the level in edit. It's very loud at the moment. And there have been times where the dialogue has been really, really quiet whilst there's been music playing. And it is very difficult to hear what the dialogue is supposed to be sometimes. Also, you know, obviously the subtitles have been on. Sometimes they're a bit of a spoiler, but all in all, it was it was pretty good. Visually, yeah, this looks great. It, it feels very real. It feels like you're stepping into the, the wizarding world and some of the attention to detail was incredible, which is why in comparison, some of the loss of detail and things like having a retry button within the flying thing or having an ability to skip through things that you've already seen if you had to like abandon a quest and come back. There's just a couple of moments like that where it felt like it wasn't necessarily... It didn't necessarily make it so... It didn't make its life easier for itself. When you're playing a game and you're in a flow, you want it to be efficient. Like, if you're in the groove of doing the time trials, then you want to just keep replying. You don't want to have to keep going all the way out to come all the way back in. It was just an extra an extra element of frustration for me because I end up doing it so often. Um, but yeah... Visually great. Sound design. As you can hear the music blaring now, the music's been amazing through it. Again, sometimes just a bit loud, as it is now, in times where you're like, do you know what, calm down music. Sometimes as well, there'd be intense music in a moment where it wasn't necessarily needed. Sometimes you'd have things like what just happened, where an audio sound from the gameplay is interrupting a cutscene, which is ever slightly annoying, but there's not a lot you can do about it. Um, we had a couple of glitches with cutscenes as well. To be fair, all in all, great game. I really thoroughly enjoyed playing it. I think the base narrative was pretty solid. There was a nice story there. None of it felt cheap. Some of the side missions felt a bit like, okay, fine, whatever. But the Seb storyline, the Poppy storyline, all very strong, um, very interesting narratives. You know, you, you felt invested. You The characters felt investable. You wanted to help them or hinder them. Sometimes I do wish there was a morality system uh, because I think there would have been moments... Like, for example, the fact you do have two different endings of the game. Or endings of the Ranrock fight, I guess. Because this is the end of the game. Um, it, moments like that where if you do follow Seb down a path, then you follow Seb down that path. And then maybe Omi isn't happy with you and you have to kind of fight with that. And just making little choices like that mean something. Because there were times where I was picking things and I was going, Oh, well, crap, I pressed the wrong button. Or, oh, shit, I made the wrong decision. Or, she definitely did not say what I thought she was going to say. Which we had more than once. Um, 
but then it comes back into but it doesn't matter because the character doesn't. it's like i accidentally told said we were working with a goblin he got really arsy with me gave us the wonderful irish jig um and then the next episode he was like oh well i need your help again so forget it i'm gonna just forgive you it's just a bit it just felt a bit like the moment as well when he was gonna run off and that mission where i i felt he should have just i spoke about it a lot in the episodes so won't go back over it too much but i felt he should have gone through with the i am just gonna run forwards i don't care if you're in stealth mode i am gonna go i'm not gonna be programmed to stay with the the character and i repeat it because i said at the time but god of war does that 2018 does that very very well in the moment sm small spoilers but in the moment where your companion goes against what you want you complete you have control of them for a while and then you completely lose control of them um in terms of the companions when you fought with people i did think most of the time they were pretty good at i'm focusing over here fighting this person so you clear some of the others uh, especially in the ranrock fight last time in that section before there were times where i was like okay i'm gonna focus on the troll and leave sharp and figgy to take care of the the goblins that kept appearing and that felt nice and balanced it felt like they were actually helping me not just there for aesthetics so that was really good um yeah controls were good story was good i thoroughly enjoyed the game i I thought it was well paced, well put together. I think there was enough times where it encouraged you to go off and do a side mission. Now, I don't know if that was just because I was in Gryffindor house. I had heard that Gryffindors get pushed to do the most side questing. So maybe that was why. But it felt well paced. It felt like those relationship missions came up at nice timings. What I do think is a bit unfair is how the Ravenclaw main student didn't have a storyline like that nat's idea poppy did seb did all the way to the end and Amit was just kind of like oh i appear on one main story quest got a bit scared so now can you just find some telescopes just felt a bit odd to have three out of four um also a bit unfair to ravenclaw uh so an interesting choice i do wonder why they did that um but all in all, I, I think it was a great game. I think it was fun. It had good emotional pacing. It had, I mean, everyone died, which was a bit much, or had someone who had died, um, <laughs> which was maybe a bit too much after a while. I was like, oh, your parents dead. Oh, your dad. Oh, your dad's dead too. Cool, crack it. Oh, you just died. Amazing. Awesome. Sweet. Uh, so maybe, maybe a bit too much of that um it just kind of got a bit repetitive there of like oh well i i even said it at one episode and i think we had four technically five on the bounce um because figgy died in the last episode so five episodes back to back where at least one character died and died in every single one of those episodes just felt like a lot of death <laughs> um but i suppose in a way i mean i don't know i don't know whether i agree with the the rookwood ending should there maybe have been like a like a hollow-esque kind of thing um not sure but yeah all in all i think it was really good really fun game very nicely paced you didn't have to do as much side questing as i did through the game you could have done it all there at the end obviously you have to get up to level 34 and i was level 33 before we came into the house cup so i can only assume if you haven't done all that stuff you then have to kind of do all that side questing. I reckon it's built that if you do that side questing, then at the end, then you get yourself up to, to level 34. It is a little bit annoying for me when you kind of get there and you're like, I've done all my side questing. I've done all my relationship quests, I've done all the main quests. I still haven't made it to level 34. It was a little bit towards the end there. Where it was just a little bit dragging. Um, but, you know, we got there in the end and uh, we finally found the end of the game. But, yeah, I, I thoroughly enjoyed it. I'd highly recommend it. I do believe there's already talks of a sequel, which will be interesting. Because I don't really know how they'll go with the sequel of this. Unless they decide to investigate your character's past. Because there's a lot of question marks on that. Or maybe other things. But the whole kind of keepers and keeper trial and that stuff. I don't think they can repeat. I've said it before, but I'll say it again. The Keeper Trials, I kind of wish all four of them had been different because the first two were the same. I don't know if I said this or if I've thought about it since, but because the first two were pretty much the same apart from the puzzles before you got to that last Pensive Keeper, um, Pensive Protector fight, the big fight that I struggled with and then learned how to do and then never needed that information again. Um... I think because the first two, the first one was what it was, and then the second one was like, it's an evolution of the first. I just expected that to follow a trend. So I thought it would be go through the Deathly Hallows thing with Neve, Neve Fitzgerald, and uh, and then face the Pensive Protector at the end, or the Pensive Warrior at the end. 
go through the grap horn thing, get into the chamber, and then face the pensive warrior. I almost wish they had have done that because it then feels a bit more satisfying. But then I do know why they didn't because obviously, well, yeah, I suppose there was a bit of fighting in the third one with the Elder Wand. And obviously you had to... Why will it enter rest mode? Don't enter rest mode. Um, and, you know, it... Sorry, got distracted. And it... Um, oh, it's all cool. Yeah, you had the fight with the grab horn as well. So I get why they did what they did. But I almost wish they'd have either done every one of them kind of the same. So you know, like, this is the boss fight. This is the pensive fight. This is what we do. I don't think that'd have been too repetitive. I feel like they did it twice. And we're like, shit, if we keep doing it, it's going to feel too repetitive. Um, but I feel like if they'd have committed to it, I don't think it would have. But at the same time, I understand why they didn't do that. So in that case, I'd have just changed number two so that all four of them were different. And I think that way my perception and my expectation of what it was going to be when I got there would have been different. But overall, very much enjoyed the game. Super looking forward to if they do another one. Very curious, very worried if they do another one though because the story has very nicely been wrapped up. All of the Seb stuff, the Nat size stuff, Poppy stuff. I mean, you can open Poppy's story up again by being like, there's another creature we need to save. Um, so I suppose that's the way you can bring her in. But then you don't want it to feel too close. Please, I don't, know, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see what they do. Um, see if they do a sequel. I know that this got a lot of a lot of attention before it released. It broke pre-sale records quite extravagantly. Um, and it will definitely be up there for Game of the Year because of that. Do I think it should win Game of the Year? I do not. Um, I don't know. It just it feels like there was too much left wanting or too much that wasn't quite there. And like I said, with games like when God of War Ragnarok came out, the day after it had released, there was a patch update. And then the week after was another. And I think in the first month, I'd or whilst I was playing that, I'd done like three or four patch updates. Whereas this, I've played for 50 hours now over three months. And it's only had two. So, there's things to be desired, for sure. It was glitchy, it was buggy. I appreciate no game is ever going to release perfectly. And in terms of this kind of day and age, I think people would prefer to just release a game and then release a patch update rather than wait until the game's perfect and then release it, which I fully understand and that's okay. But I guess I just want patch updates faster. But to not end on a sour note, of course, I did really enjoy this game. I hope you did too. Uh, as I've said too many times, if you want to see me fully complete the game, that's 100% okay with me. Um, it will be a lot like the end of this episode was in terms of running around and looking for things. But we do still have the Felix Felices to use in the castle, which is just where all of the secret chests and things are. Um, it lasts for uh, a game day, which is 48 minutes, I think. So we can always come back and do that. Please leave a like on this video if you want that. And let me know in the comments section. Yes, come back in a live stream. This is the last episodic episode of this game. It's done now. We have completed everything. Um, but if you want to see more, please do let me know. And we'll come back in some live streams. Let's skip these credits because they're going on for a while. And see what happens when we come back in the game. Quest complete. The house cup. All right. And that's it now. So if I go to my quest list, no assignments, no stories available. That's it. That's all done. There's nothing more to do. 71%. I said about 70 I thought we'd get to. So still 29% of this game to go. There's still six more levels we can level up. There's still plenty of Merlin trials and secret Hogwarts locations. There's two more of those to find plus much much more so as i said if you want to see some more we will come back in a live stream but you will have to let me know otherwise i'll just keep playing god of war ragnarok on live streams because i really want to complete that game too but for now that is it that is all i have to show you for hogwarts legacy i hope you enjoyed this video and all 49 others that are in this playlist uh, i hope if you want to you've binged them you've watched them you've enjoyed coming along with the ride for us it's been a long one this one uh much longer than Ragnarok was although they were longer episodes I think they were an hour and a half but this is always fun I always like having a game that's something that we all kind of pull into and, and do together on the channel and spend a bit of time and sit down and, and you can really get your teeth into it and you know if you've got 50 hours to spare you can watch it all over again but that is going to do it for us today I will be back with other games soon very very soon if you want to have a your say 
a your say. But if you want to have your say in what we play and when we play it on this channel, please head over to the Circuit the World Discord that's over there in the link on the screen and down in the description box below where you can have your say in what games we start to play, when we're going to play them. I do polls periodically to ask you what you want to see coming up on the channel next. You guys have your say and your sway, or, you know, you can shout me at the comments. But that is the best way to do it because that's where I'll run polls if I'm running polls. So before I ramble on any longer, because I've rambled on enough, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. It's been an absolute blast, as always. If you enjoyed this video, go show that like button some good old-fashioned love. And if you want to support the channel, go hit subscribe and ring that bell so you don't miss next time I upload a video. Stay awesome, and I will see you all. Oh my god, I can't believe how long it took us. We've done it! It is over. Holy shit.